What's up guys, if you want cheap, fast, reliable AMT, make sure to hit up my sponsor and use code BUGS for 5% off checkout. Links down below in the description. Hit them up right now. What's good YouTube? It's your boy BUGS back on another NBA 2K21 My Team video. And guys, today we are going over the top snipe filters of the week pretty much and before we get into the video guys make sure to smash that like button let's hit 50 likes in this video giveaway winner will be announced on monday so if you guys did not enter the giveaway make sure to enter it. it's on twitter and instagram follow those socials and also i do sell mt if you guys need mt to build that god squad make sure to hit me up in the comments section and um hit me up on twitter but yo let's get into these snipe filters man there is a lot of snipe filters to make you guys a lot of mt and before we do get into it man this is the squad, man. This is all sniping. This is all sniping. This is NMS, bro. No money spent, bro. Only money I spent was day one. That's the only time I spent money. And here it is, man. This is the GOAT squad, guys. Um, let's get us some snipe filters to help you guys make lots of MT. So let's get a snipe filter number one, and it's Diamond Finals Minimum Buyout. This snipe filter right here is absolutely insane. You do need at least 100K to work with this snipe filter. If you do get LeBron, if you do get Magic, you're going to make a minimum of 50,000 MT plus. Minimum, bare minimum 50,000 plus. If you get LeBron, you're going to make about 100K. If you get Magic, you're going to make at least 50K. So this filter right here, if you do get a snipe, you're going to make a lot of MT. If you snipe 10 per day, you're going to make a minimum of 500,000 MT. So if you're one of those people that like to grind at auction, this snipe filter to start off with is absolutely incredible, man. Let's get a snipe filter number two. This one is interesting. It is diamond, I think, eastern. And uh, yes, this is the one. First off, all you need to have is, um, I believe one of the cards is Alonzo Mourning and maybe Isaiah Thomas. And then you can scroll down to the three hour mark and honestly right here i don't even need those cards you could honestly scroll down pretty easily and right there is an ai for 100k that card right there is a decent card to pick up alan iverson is really only 100k but you could maybe flip him for like 110 so right there that card for 100k is actually a pretty damn good value uh let's see if yeah he was already bought out so that alan iverson for that price was a very good value on the eastern filter next filter is going to be um diamond western this filter is also very good you could get a lot of snipes and yo who's ready for football bills are on a tuesday i'm hyped but yo western i believe i have deron williams so i can enable that out and it looks like you do need mark eaton now to actually make this filter a lot easier so you need deron williams mark eaton and possibly a jason kid and this filter is insane you just gotta wait a little bit you never know what you get on these filters right there 66k mark Eaton, 63k mark eaton if i enough mt i would definitely scoop that up but yo, that's a very good filter as well, man. This Western filter is absolutely incredible. You never know what you can get on it. Let's get into a next filter, man. This is for budget ballers right here. It's the Ruby filter, and it's around 1,500 MT. Um, this filter should be pretty damn cash. You could get a lot of cards for the low, like that card right there, and we missed it. He's going for like 2,500. Nikola Jokic for 1,000. So as you guys can see, the auction house glitch is still a thing. But if you do get some of these cards, you're going to make lots of MT. Uh, right here, a bunch of Bobby Jones up here for 1200 Oh, Byron Scott for 1000 That's a snag. I'm picking up all these Byron Jones because that's how you're going to make easy profit, man. Oh, we forgot the Nikola Jokic, and we got that one too. So right there, we just made a bunch of profit. I would say over 2000 MT profit just off that one refresh, man. These Bobby Jones are already bought out. Bobby Jones gonna go for 2k, same with Jokic. So right there, easy W's, easy MT made. Not only that, this is a very way, easy way to co complete your collection, get your collector level up, get them tokens up. So yeah, this filter right here is absolutely incredible. And also, if you guys did do good in the $250,000 tournament, let me know down below. I literally didn't play it. I literally lost all hope because it didn't work for me at first. So I was absolutely so pissed. So let me know if you guys did do good in a 250k. I know Ty Debo got screwed and so did TJ Air Day. Um, but yeah, anyways, let's get into the next filter, man. It's Pink Diamond. If you guys don't know, Mount Ginobili, Moses Malone, Brandon Roy, and Dominique Wilkins is on here. And oh my God, Moses Malone is under 100,000 MT. And that's honestly very, very hard to believe. So this filter is somewhat ruined unless you do pick up Moses Malone. If you have Moses Malone, this filter's money. But I'm surprised that Moses Malone is actually that easy to pull. That's kind of crazy. He's a beast on defense. 
and uh, this filter is definitely good. You do have to scroll a little bit if you don't have Moses Malone, but y'all, you never know what could pop up. You get Dominique Wilkins, man. Dominique Wilkins. And I did sell Amal Ginobili two days ago for 170k. Downey Wilkins at 225k, but then again, he does have a shoe. He's going for like 160. If you have Dominique, if you want to sell him, it's a good time too. He's not really going to rise this much from that price. So if you want, it's up to you. Dominique is not a bad sell right now. Um, there's a couple other filters. You never know you can get on that pink dime filter. Let's get into the next filter. Ah, there's 20. This filter right here has been money all year for me. It's been absolutely cash, no enabled. 14,400. You never know what could pop up. A Giannis could pop up. A Curry could pop up. A LeBron could pop up. An AD could pop up. You get a lot of cards in this filter. It's definitely worth a try. You never know what could pop up. This filter is definitely good for people who have like 20,000 MT. Um, it does take a little patience. It's a lot better on content days. So on content days, this filter is going to be 110% times better. So content days, man, it's definitely going to be beastly. Um, Manu Ginobili's guys, should you sell Manu? It's up to you. I wouldn't sell him yet. I don't think it's a good idea. I think he's a beast. And I do not think it's time to sell Manu. I think we got to wait till possibly when the set drops. But um, if you could get your hands on one for under 100k, most definitely scoop that Manu Ginobili up. But uh, yeah, here it is, man. This filter is absolutely cash. Next filter, man, it's just Amethyst around 7k. Um, pretty much every other car besides Luis Scola and Reed are a snipe. So if you see anything else, man, that pops up, make sure to scoop it up. It's definitely a snipe. Um, anything other than Willis Reed and Luis Scola, like I said. And this filter would be absolutely money. You never know what could pop up on this Amethyst filter, man. I did scoop up a, a Luis Scola, I think yesterday. I got him for like 6k and I sold him for 8k. Uh, you could do that if you want with Luis Scola. It's completely up to you. He's good for quick profit. He does sell pretty fast. So uh, if you want, you could try out that filter. There is a couple other filters, man. We're going to go over this one. This is a badge filter, man. It's range extender. Range extender filter. This one's crazy. I heard one of my subs, I think it was King Pepe YT, shout out to you. He said he was sniping a ton of range extenders for around 10K and selling them for like 20. So uh, as you guys can see right here, range extenders going for around 15,000, 14,000 MT, um, 2,500. And uh, if you guys want, put your damn filter to around, I don't know, this is a good price right here. And then just snipe. You never know what's going to pop up. If something pops up for around 10k, buy it out, especially if it's a gold range extender, guys. That's a big badge. This badge right here is definitely a good snipe. Not only that, another good snipe is clamps. So if you do have clamps up here, it's also a very good thing to snipe. Uh, let's see, it might be like 7,000-ish. Yeah, man, so we're like 7,000 or 7,700. You could possibly snipe out of clamps. You never know. You never know what could pop up on this filter. If something pops up for like 5K, you're gonna make a pretty decent profit and it definitely adds up. So these badge filters right here, clamps, range extender. I think Dead Eyes actually a good one as well. Let's see if Dead Eyes around here. Um Dead Eye. Dead Eyes a nah, Dead Eye is not the best. It's decent. Some badges that you could literally some badges are gonna be pretty good snipes, but Dead Eye is not the best. Gold and silver Dead Eye is definitely better than bronze. But it's not a bad badge. Those are pretty much the three best badges I can think of right now. They're definitely his other ones. Um, if you guys do know off the top of the head, make sure to drop it down in the comments. So my subs will definitely know. Um, other than that, man, to be honest, my favorite snipe filter right now, like I said, is definitely this one. I think there's the most action on Diamond Final Snipe Filter. And I think you guys can make a lot of MT off this Diamond Final Snipe Filter. Um... Pretty much, guys. That's really all we got. Uh, let's check out the Pink Dime filter one more time. Moses Malone is a buyout. If you guys do want to sell him, be my guest. He's most likely just going to continuously drop down in value. And uh, yeah, if you have Dominique, it's not a bad time to sell now. Mono Ginobili wouldn't sell. Brennan Roy, you could sell. His price is going to rise from there. But yo, that's all we got for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy. Stay tuned for more content, guys. Have a good one. Stay blessed. Peace. What's up, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit me up on Instagram and Twitter. I am buying and selling MT. Hit me up right now.